Hi friend, my name is Turi Madagwa. In this short video, we want to learn how to send unlimited email using a free web mailing software. Now, in order for you to reach clients or business partners all over the world, email marketing is one of the best way to market all over the world. So it is very good for you to send emails on a daily basis. You can use this method to send over a million emails on a daily basis. All you need to do is to get our guide on how to create SMTP. You create this SMTP, then you now use it, put it in this free software I'm going to talk about. Now the software is actually called Mailbed. You can download it on your PC. It's free, though they also have a paid version, but the free is okay for now. And you add multiple accounts, that's multiple SMTP, and you use it to send. Each of the SMTP will be determined by how you generate it and all that. Now, basically, most of the SMTPs I generate send like 500 percent. So you can generate multiple and add all of them together and send. So it is very easy. Step one, you get your SMTP. Step two, you download Mailbed. Then step three, you add your email and you send. So let's get into my PC and see the practical demonstration on how to go about it. Okay, so this is the software we are going to use. It is actually called Mailbed. All you need to do is to get to their website, get Mailbed, G E T M A I L, then bed.com. You just download it on your PC and you make use of it. So when you download it on your PC, this is how it is. So this is how it works. Now I'll just like, um, so while it's opening, let me use this few seconds to talk about what you really need. You can get this uh, video guide. Um, it's actually called Buck Email Server. So with this guide, you just pay $20. It will teach you how you generate unlimited um, email server. That's SMTP that you use and all that. It is better for you to generate it so that you'll be sending it little by little and all that. So you, you might there might be no need for you to buy a web mailer, PHP mailer, and all that that goes to spam so you'll be generating it yourself okay so let's get back to the software i think it should be ready now. okay so when you open it so this is how it's going to look like now so all i need to do now is just to put the title of your email that's the name of your company your sender and all that so i can say mine let me just use my name which is turi madagua okay then this is where you now put your SMTP email. So like this one, now let me use my email, which is I think paul at pauljumbo.com, okay? So I'll click on continue. So it's going to detect my SMTP server settings, depending on the speed of your internet, but usually some few seconds, it should be done, okay? So once you have that, you make sure that um, when you have your SMTP details like this, like this is what I have, this is like the SMTP notes. This particular one that I'm using is just directly from my email server. I didn't configure it to send bulk, but because I'm just doing a demo. Because when you are configuring to send bulk, there are some settings. So when you get our video, you now show, we will now show you so that you'll be able to send as much as 120,000 per one account and you can put unlimited accounts here to send so this is my smtp settings now so i'll just copy my server details here which is this so here authentication you see it so i'll just click here use my username and pass and um, so here you use imap don't use pop3 so i'll put my server details which is what i copied here now you now put the port you see the port that it comes with imap port which is 993 so when you get a advanced video we'll show you how you generate all these things they are very easy you can do unlimited and the rest so on encryption i'm going to choose ssl so it's going to send your email securely because if you don't send your email securely this is one of the reasons why your mail go to spam because the server that is receiving your email we assume your email is not secured so it's very important. So here yeah, now, now put my username and pass of the SMTP, which is Paul at pauljumbo, pauljumbo.com. Then I'm going to put my password here. Okay. 
so here connections you can still leave it at five so here now you now put your smtp details which is still the same this that's outgoing server then i'll click here then here you choose an inscription the same thing then you now put requires authentications so it's going to pick this for you by default so my SM my smtp server port i think is different it is 465 so you've seen it so i'll just come here now and change it to 465 so it has picked it by default so i'll just click here on continue so if everything goes well it will tell you that everything is goes well so the number of smtp you have so usually what i normally do for my business you can connect it to facebook and the rest then also this software you can do a lot you can add google to read you can add whatsapp facebook all and you'll be using it to so you have just one software to you have just one software to control all your clients both on whatsapp and the rest so that's how i do but this is just my recording pc so you can see now it has opened all my emails so i can use this now to send and reply emails and the rest okay so that's that about this so let me just close this okay so i can read my email now i can now respond and do the rest so for me to send my emails now using the web mailer now i'll just click here on compose so once i click on here on compose now it's going to open then um, you choose what you want to send so you can see it has picked my name which is to Madagua, then the email i'm sending it to then um, i'll just click on to let me just put one of my email kumla04 at gmail.com now when you are adding your additional emails since you are sending bulk you now use bcc and make sure you are doing like 200 which is okay so you just since you have multiple accounts you just be doing it and also we have a way of scheduling it so when you get our advanced video will teach you how you schedule it so that it will be sending it on your behalf instead of you doing it manually so let me just copy my email let me just copy small so this video will not be too long and um, put an email that I can verify so I can confirm if it goes to inbox. So I've pasted it here, my emails. So I'll just put the title here so I can say, uh, let's say, let's say test or something, okay? I don't want it to be too long, test. So this is where you, like, you can now put your email, you can now put your videos, you can attach, you can click here, you can attach files to read, maybe software, anything, you can put image and all that. Then you just click on send the advantage of making use of this software is that it doesn't send them in bulk it will just be it will just schedule it so that the server the receiving server will not see it as a spam email so it's like it's going little by little and all that so let me just show us some other things here in this software so i'll just click here now here and you click on settings so under the settings you see here we have appearance you can change your appearance and all that but the most important thing i'll talk about is the account so here now you can now click here and add account so you can just keep adding smtp smtp so let's assume that i have like 10 smtp here and each of the smtp can send 500 emails per hour so with the 10 you are talking about 50,000 emails so this is how i do i used to send millions of email because i generate this smtp so from now you stop buying smtp expensively so you just get a uh, server information for just 20 dollars if you are in nigeria you get it for just eight thousand naira. so once you get it you generate this smtp unlimited and they all goes to inbox because you are sending it little by little and all that okay so let me just close this so on that year now you now see the information that you sent you've seen it which is this test so i think it has gone so let me go to my email then um, let me just refresh to confirm if they've actually come okay so now i have actually go to my email so this is the first email that i had which is komla04 you can see the gmail went to inbox you can see now that it's in my inbox none went to spam then this other one is actually um you've seen it also inbox then the yahoo to also inbox then the webmail to also inbox so that's all you need to do to create and 
thank you now for watching this video i would like you to subscribe on our channel because we'll be sending more of this video on a daily basis so please kindly subscribe and also like this video and also follow us on social media where you get our tips so that you'll be the very first person to get our tips and everything we do thank you